So I want to point out this idiot has Avalanche guys and then Wayne Gretzky on his wall. Bandwagoner. It is a 20% on Rotten Tomatoes based off five critic reviews. Oh, one guy one liked guy it. One guy liked it. One guy loved it. It was me. You can see, even this monkey can get up before eight. Why can't you? I fucking hate waking up. The monkey doesn't have depression. I do. I like to imagine this as a spin-off prequel of the monkey from Speed Racer. <laughs> it's definitely the same monkey. I, the movie's gonna be... end with Spritel kidnapping him. There are three separate monkeys, I believe, that played this monkey, actually. They all just look exactly the same, but... Yeah, because they're monkeys. Can you imagine if monkeys made a human movie and had three separate humans play the same guy? I feel like I need a tube TV to watch this. So there's a Wikipedia page that summarizes this film. The film's title character, Jack, is a funny monkey. Citation needed. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> There's no production section. No history at all. We're just watching Encino Man again, aren't we? Br but Brendan Fraser, this time, is a monkey. It's the same cool at school plot that she's going to use the monkey to get friends that like her. I wish I was a monkey that could play hockey. This is my ideal movie, by the way, everybody. Yeah, Let's we watch know. It. I'm not talking to you guys. I'm talking to the audience that can't reply back besides comment form. My ideal film is in HD. My ideal film is in standard definition. <laughs> My ideal film has more than 18 pixels. <laughs> There's like 20. If anyone out there has a Blu-ray 4K <laughs> copy of MVP Most Valuable Primate, mail it to me. Whoa, does the monkey get paid? This is labor that shouldn't be happening. By God, there really is no rule against a monkey playing. Nuggets. Nuggets. <laughs> That's not how hockey practice works. This is pro wrestling on ice. I'd watch that. I would too. And the goal over here, All right, that's Jimmy, our uh, Keith Magoo. He was the top rookie choice of the WHL, believe it or not. Really? Top rookie choice of the WHL. You know what a fucking prestigious honor that is? California High School Hockey League Championship Team. Do not even have ice in California? <laughs> there are three NHL teams in California, you dickhead. <laughs> All right, penalty. You know, I really hate to break it to you, but this is not gonna follow rules of regular hockey. Uh, monkey's that's... gonna be on the field. <laughs> yeah. However, <laughs> I, I I will be calling out the intricacies of the game. All right, but as long as you recognize and call out the monkey that will play hockey. Oh, that's later in the film. A hey, showboating. Jesus Christ. Get him. Penalty. Oh my God! They <laughs> they just assaulted him. Yes. Imagine getting a new teammate and then injuring him, even though he's better than every person on your fucking team. Is that Kirk Douglas? It's like being a Cubs fan. <laughs> That's before, funny. Before, like, two years ago. This team of assholes who can't play, and then they get someone who can teach them to play. That's a penalty. That's Moneyball. <laughs> this guy's form is awful. I know, he dove where the pick wasn't. That guy didn't even deke, he just, like, sat there. Alright, everyone get the fuck off the ice, they scored once. One ticket to El Simeon, please. Well, you see, this is pre-9-11, so, like, there's nothing weird about talking into a bag. As opposed to after, where he said, bomb, go off, and then it did. <laughs> okay, Siri, trigger the bomb. Give this to the taxi driver. Give this 1900s $10 bill. It's so old, it doesn't even have the guy on the 10 on it. It's just a banknote for ten dollars of gold. <laughs> I'm really glad this guy's not gonna be in the rest of the movie because he's the worst actor in the I film. I think he is in the rest of the movie. He's in the movie. No, he's not. He's in the, all the movies so far. This old guy? No. Yes. Well, he's not old. He's uh, not even this, old. This pixelated guy. <laughs> <laughs> that guy's dead. Like that is a dead man. Look at those two radical dudes. One of them is Limp Biscuit, right? Dude, they literally just set a scene to go. They're like, oh, it's, the ref's a home team guy. He's not gonna call any penalties against us. That's not legal. Why is this the league so evil. unruly? There are zero leagues in the entire world that are like this. This is high school, man. And how is one of them like one of the top world picks for an NHL? He was. A WHL. It's not even that the Nuggets are like the worst team ever. It's just it's every other team cheats. Are, yeah, the referees are blatantly evil. Is that why they're going to let the monkey in? Because they don't give a shit? Four! You're out of here! He's the only guy that gets kicked out of the game. Oh, he did jump into the bench. That's actually the only rule that they followed so far. So what you're saying is 19 infractions they ignored, and then the 20th, they're like, oh, that guy needs to go. It's like a punch card. Yep. It's you like free soup. Number. You get 20 strikes and you're out. Like, why even show up to this game? What's if the, the team just has a free pass to just beat the shit out of your players, that kid had to be dragged off the ice. Yeah, but God forbid you jump through the thing. All right, no one's going to scout the worst junior B hockey team in the history of the planet, all right? This is what I hate in um, movie Movies. writing when a character is communicating in a way that we can't understand. But the reverse shots and then they go, what? You're telling me blah, 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 the entire thought that they're supposed to convey because they can't convey it. I would just rather have it subtitled. Yeah. yeah. 
That way you don't have to go, what do you mean the bridge is falling down? Yeah, this monkey is like Caesar in Rise of the Planet of the Apes intelligent. And he's going to use all that intelligence and power to, to play, play hockey, hockey really well. Damn fucking right. Who wins at hockey? MVP or Caesar? Caesar. MVP. No, MVP has hockey experience. Caesar doesn't. Caesar would Caesar murder would MVP. Caesar would adapt, but in a game of 60-minute hockey, adapting throughout all of that, you have the, like, 40 minutes of learning that you're going to be behind. How many kids do you know that can speak to- What do you mean they don't like you? What do you mean you're sad? He just, like, stole someone's treehouse. That's a nice, elaborate treehouse. A lot That's of a stuff. nice-ass tree. Look, Look at that. that. That's beautiful. That's gonna cost more than the house I'm probably gonna buy. Yeah. That's where the budget went. Yep. The budget went to the treehouse, training the monkey. That's it. Four million dollars. Oh, he would have to suck so- He can't lift the puck off the ice. He was next to the- that doesn't count at all. It's like shouting Kobe and then just slamming the fucking yeah, used slam cum dunk. napkin into No, the that, that's the thing thing that you do. You practice roofing a puck when you're close in. It's not a show of skill at all. Oh my yeah. god, what's that? A caveman? Better not show my parents. <laughs> what's the matter? What happened? Um. Did you see a monkey in the woods? What do you mean a monkey in the woods? What do you mean he ran away? What do you mean he's MVP? We're gonna be late for school, we gotta go. We're gonna be late for school. You should be practicing hockey if you're gonna be late for school. Oh, yeah. you should what, it seemed like it was pretty late in the day, honestly. Yeah, the sun it was seems up. like it's already like midday. Also, there was like one bush. You couldn't just look behind the bush for the monkey? Oh, that's cool. It's from her perspective because she's fucking deaf. Yeah. Oh. That's actually really good. Wow, that's like a good scene at all. Holy wow. shit. This wow. would be more impactful if they didn't blatantly beat you over the head with our isolation earlier. He's definitely gonna paint his white suit. Why else would he be dressed in so much yep. white? Every white. Tie white. That white. Blazer white. Face white. <laughs> Mario Lou red. Oh, uh, no, he, he no. stepped in himself. We don't even get to see it? If I have a pure white suit, I'm not walking into a just, like, wet painted room. I'll stay outside and put my head in. We didn't even get to see the splotch of paint on his jacket. What's the point of the visual gag? Oh my god, that ladder is so unsafe for a ten-year-old child. It's also super thin that, like, bolts it into the wood. Look at that. Yeah, There's also banana peels on them. You can slip right off. That's easy for you to say, man. That's easy for you to say, because I'm not a good actor. That's what happens when you're passed up by the scouts. We're not going to get drafted for the NHL, so we're not going to play. Bro, if everyone had that mentality, no one would ever fucking play sports. All right, monkey. I'm breaking you into my house. He's from Estonia. Linkovich Chomovsky. Don't tell my parents. He's an exchange student from Planet of the Apes. All right, he's a monkey. <laughs> he's just a monkey. I'm sorry. <laughs> I, yeah. I tried to lie. What, you just close your door? That was so weird. I turned around dramatically. Listen, just tell me if you see anything, all right? She did, and you didn't listen, jackass. The story of Jack, a fun-loving, scene-stealing primate with a penchant for ice hockey. Scene-stealing? That's just lying about the movie. How far into this movie are we? <laughs> Don't time check. I need time to check. know. We're, we're, we're halfway, halfway through? We are 40 minutes in. He has not once touched the fucking rink. <laughs> This coffee just magically appeared. I guess I won't question it. That bowl was full. That bowl was overflowing. Yeah, that was not. What was going on there? Where's the, where's the continuity? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, it's rose full again. It went down a second time. Oh, please keep cutting back and forth. Just cut back and forth for the next 40 changed. minutes. <laughs> he just goes back upstairs! <laughs> yeah, alright. I mean, what else would you do? That's true. You sit down and eat with the monkey? No. Ian? Yeah. He's about to. He's getting us with the monkey. That's what I would do. See, Mud, we have different priorities. Yeah. My priorities are spending time with monkey, and yours are, what the fuck, why is there a monkey here? He dropped the cereal. <laughs> <laughs> he went all the length to pour this ever-shrinking bowl of cereal. Where did this monkey even come from? The they lab. Did, they did not set up the monkey's origin at all. Yeah, he was just did. somewhere, then he went on a train, missed his stop, and now he's playing hockey. <laughs> like, they didn't establish- They had an hour, almost, to they establish They have 40 minutes monkey. to do anything at all. It feels like magic! He just missed that one. Wow, the monkey does suck at hockey. This is a terrible idea. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> what the yeah, that way, that's gonna happen more. <laughs> I will throw that out there. How 
strong is that monkey? Did you hear the sound effect? <laughs> yeah. Is it true that many of the alumni have threatened to withhold their donations this year until Jack is found unharmed? Who fucking cares? So I'm nice to finally meet yeah. you. We're early. Oh, just an hour. Oh. <laughs> That's super fucking early. That's like way early. If someone showed up to my house an hour early, I'd make them leave. This isn't even the best movie I've seen with a chimpanzee in the lead role. We are halfway through the movie! You know what and they're just getting to the premise! You know what the thing is? I'm pretty sure someone says, nobody says a monkey can't play hockey. Which is the Airbud rule. Yeah, but this... This is the same studio! Why do people think this is a good genre of this film? Better... It has to sell something on DVD, right? It's got to sell some serious numbers. I mean, I've, I owned it on VHS, so They yeah. made three of these fucking things. It bombed at the theaters. They did. It made Well, the other two low. are directed DVD sequels. I bet they fucking were. The, with Chimpsky. Rib Chimpsky. Rib Chimpsky. Rib Chimpsky? Yep. Rib Chimpsky. Linkovich Chimofsky. <laughs> There's even a scene in Encino Man where they go to the hockey rink. It's like children's Encino Man. Too many men on the ice. Yeah, that's the problem. I mean, it's still a penalty. It's not even a man on the ice. Uh, you're right, so they can cheat. Whose name is Rib Chimsky? Looks like Rib Chimsky is back. Wait a minute, that can't be. Why did you think it was Rib Chimsky? He's very clearly not human. Look at that sped up footage. Wow. New guy's fast. That's no. clearly a fucking monkey! Damn, he's fast. They're overcranking the footage. Monkey's finally playing hockey. It's like an hour into the movie. His shirt's on backwards. I didn't even realize it for a second. Yeah, I'm too distracted by there being a monkey playing hockey. Yeah, that's that's actually what distracted me. Ineligible player. No goal. I'm also booing. The monkey should have a goal allowed. No. I know the rules of the game. That should be allowed. Because you're aware that there's no rule that says he can't play. <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. You're fainting at a month. Okay, good. Oh, she's not fainting. She already had a headache. Say, it's not that shocking of a sight. It's kind of funny, actually. It is He's got funny. clothes on. Nobody seems to be missing a chimp. All the chimps at the zoo seem to be accounted for. Hello, zoo? Do you have all your chimps? This yes. is a threat. <laughs> <laughs> Why, yes, we do, sir. We are the zoo, and we just counted our chimps. Can you double check? We have oh, a wait, chimp here. Wait, hold on. He's going to say there's no rule the monkey can't play. Think of all the increased revenue, Harry. It's a good argument. I mean, at least we'll win at the box office. No, you won't. <laughs> no, you will not. Got it. You will make a quarter of your budget at the box office. So this is a way better explanation because it's all greed-driven. Yeah. I mean, a bear fought in World War II, so... Yeah. <laughs> By that logic, they would have a monkey fight in hockey. The board has officially amended the rules, so the Jack here... Oh, it's not even that they didn't see a rule that said no. They amended, they the, amended rules the rules. They amended the rules. So that's so fucking funny. It's as if the writers knew how terrible the Airbud Clause was, and they wrote in that these people change the, the rules. The shirt behind Jack just says, ugh. All right, we're finally into some monkey playing hockey scenes. There's 30 minutes left There's in the movie. There's no time for a story. Is there even drama? Like, what's that's the- That's the same shot from before. What's the worst thing that's gonna happen to the main character if he doesn't, like, win this game? Um, they'll put hepatitis in the monkey. That's not it. Are you serious? That's, yeah, that's what. That's why they sent him away. Wait a minute! The monkey is back! <laughs> Wait a minute, the monkey, monkey is, is back! Citation needed, citation found. Don't worry, Jack, all right? They're all cheering for you. Well, yeah, I guess they are. You know yeah. what else are they going to cheer for? The blind goalie? Even if you trained a monkey like his whole life, I don't think he could play hockey. Jake, I hate to tell you, I don't think the movie cares. <laughs> <laughs> the monkey's here, and she brought him to school, that now she's going to be popular at school. <laughs> <laughs> when does the monkey climb the wall in the background? This is just diet and see no man. When does he drive? When is he a hell of a pilot, kid? Drive car on two legs. Of course I can see. I didn't shoot the puck, Magoo. It took the whole movie to get to this point where I'm they amazed it. it had time for a subplot about how the goalie needs glasses. Yeah, let's start the subplot. Uh, how far are we? Almost at the end. <laughs> and now she's popular at school and has friends. Yep. I'm amazed at how much time this movie can waste. Did you expect it to not waste? The hour and a half it took. You make a fantastic point. You just broke that kid's neck. Yeah, yeah. We're gonna see one puck that the monkey shoots at like bullet speeds and it's gonna like tear through someone's abdomen. It's gonna be that shot where the camera pulls back from the hole yeah. and it's just blood dripping. Jake, think about it this way. You get to watch this movie again to edit it. Oh, thank God. Does overtime not exist in this world? Well, they just won because of that, so no. Leading them to win the Junior B Championship. Wait a minute, wait a minute. The local hockey team's board edited the rules for their local hockey team. I don't think the, like, world NHL people 
Oh, the, fuck you, I'm not playing a team with a monkey on it. Exactly, they would never change <laughs> Yeah, their but that's forfeiting the match. National rules. Who cares? No, the, the Nuggets need to forfeit the match. Yeah, that's not forfeit. They, they just wouldn't let them treat. play. Then every team is going to have, like, super monkeys that can fire Mach 10 picks at the fucking net. Vancouver, Canada. Ah, where they shot this movie. Wait, this is an international hockey league. Why the fuck is the monkey allowed to play? Polar. Nuggets versus polar bears. The bears have a bear on their team. Oh my god! Are you serious? No, I'm not serious. Why not? Welcome to Harvest Cup, section 117. I did not check the ticket. Yeah, I know. Well, they also walked past him. Like, that was very poorly blocked. What arena did they use for this? 40, 27, 31. I was, I was naming the ages of everyone getting onto the ice. And as usual, the stands are full of scouts tonight. Oh, please tell me one of them recruits the fucking monkey. They do a trade, the monkeys and the other team. It's the perfectly white suit guy. Well, finally. That's his whole character. That's why he exists. Oh my god. A visual gag. So they used Rogers Arena to film this. The home of the actual NHL team in the Vancouver Canucks. Hey, what's up? <laughs> Some guys want to take Jack? What do you mean someone's here to steal Jack? <laughs> god damn it. <laughs> no, I fucking hate you. This arena holds 19,000 people, and they got it for this movie. And they got 19,000 I think I see spent. where the budget went. Yeah. Three million was venting the arena. Booking all of Roger's arena. I mean, if they just said, like, it's a stupid hour and a half monkey movie for kids from the Air Bud movie series, they'd if probably be If I sure. owned Roger's arena, they could use it for free. I, I know they're taking you away at the end of the game. We need to take him away. He needs to be a skateboarder next movie. I knew this would be a bad movie, but it's really uninteresting. Yeah. I thought it would be very, like, cartoonish and We go, what funny. the fuck is that every three seconds? Yeah, and there's a no, few of those moments. there's just nothing happening. I don't even know if I'm checked out, because I was never checked in. It's one-to-one. -one. It's a close game. It's like the fucking Super Bowl two years ago. Uh, mm -hmm. Fun fact, hockey, not a high-scoring sport. Oh, okay. is Jack going to come in and make the perfect shot? Yep, here comes the monkey. A fucking fight? Let's get it. That's illegal. Monkey That's goaltender interference. All of this is illegal. They're it's all literally fighting. just turning into, like, a full-on fight. Yeah, they're fist this is the rumble at the end of The Outsiders. That is the least impressive goal Jack has scored yet. Uh, you guys are missing something very big. That's also illegal. There's no rule saying a middle schooler can't play. <laughs> hey. We gotta send you away to be in most vertical primate. <laughs> we got someone who's gonna adopt you, Tony Hawk. <laughs> Wait, that'd be fucking sick. <laughs> I would watch that. I was considering, as a joke, recommending MVP2 as my next pick. But I, I'm I, so uninterested in this movie. I would quit the show. I think I just hang myself. Excuse me, sir. The plane's trying to fucking take off. Can you get to your seat? You may want to discuss this with your folks. I want them to be on the Vancouver Canucks. Wow, your monkey slash sister did so well with that winning point. We want you and only you to join. Buddy, where have you been? What took you so long? I had to play and win hockey. <laughs> that, <laughs> that's an excuse, yes. <laughs> what do you mean? You joined a high school <laughs> hockey team. Thank yeah. fuck. All right, guys, wow. out of time. Yikes. Um, um, Jesus. Oh, that's sweet. Yeah, the rest of the movie blows. Um, zero. I see nothing here. I see nothing even ironically funny. Maybe a little bit, but like. Bernie Mac. <laughs> it's not even worth like watching, for any reason. I okay. agree. Okay. Yeah. Um, no. This I, is even zero. if I were like. Like Ian, where I'm a huge fan of monkeys and hockey and stuff. First of all, the hockey is total shit. Oh, hockey's so bad. Um, second, the monkey is just acting out like stage motions. He's not really in his own movie, oddly enough. And none of the universe makes sense. None of the, what the monkey does makes sense. The humans are terribly written. It feels like, like even like a Hallmark movie has like story at all. So, Sucked. yeah, zero. zero. Okay. Um. I know this movie is a zero, fun fact. Uh, as I, While watching it, I'm like, oh, this is bad. P pure nostalgia and entertainment of Monkey and Hockey. I have to give it a completely separate score of maybe five. But this movie is a zero. <laughs> like, it's so bad. Holy shit, man. There is nothing there. I see nothing You're completely correct. This is, like, one of the worst movies we've ever watched in this show. I agree. I'm putting it on, like, the bottom of the list. Or anything. It didn't, like, piss me off in, like, an angry way. Oh, like, like Scorpion this. King? Where yeah. Like, I, was this never, yeah. I was never hating it. Yeah, yeah, this isn't a Scorpion King it's like that. It's pure apathy while watching it. Yeah, yeah I, I, I had um, no strong feelings yeah. for anything. It's as if I were watching a wall. <laughs> I don't even know how to commentate on it. There's nothing here. Yeah, it's understandable. I'm just shocked. Like, I thought I'd have material. 
I don't. The movie gave us nothing. It gave us nothing. Understandable. We made we made commentary out of it, obviously. I feel like but... I haven't yet watched the movie. That's fair. I don't know. I'm in a weird place right now. <laughs> That's okay. That's tough. Uh, All right, Mud, unless you have anything else to add. Nope, it's my turn. Right. Um, so... I, I, monkey, hockey, he who. That's all I got. So, um, we've watched some pretty radical movies this round. We watched Encino Man, then we watched MVP. I'm gonna cap it off with another radical movie from the 90s. Great. Um, this, much like Ian, I know this is definitely a bad movie, but I also really love this movie for its sheer absurdity. You guys know Leonardo DiCaprio, right? No, I've never heard of him. Alright, well this is one of his earlier films. We're watching Romeo plus Juliet. Oh. Fuck yeah! Wait! <laughs> I hate this stupid fucking movie. It's so it's bad, so but it's so good. entertaining. We talked about it yesterday. Oh, I wanted to tell you. I was oh, so close man. to telling you yesterday. Dude, fuck yeah! That movie's oh, so man. entertaining. You were like, you know, Romeo and Juliet, it's a musical. And I went, it's a Romeo, musical? I told you, I, we were talking about musicals yesterday. We were talking about In the Heights. Yeah, and I was like, yeah, Romeo plus Juliet. You, you were like, that's a musical? I'm like, no, but the sword's a gun. And <laughs> was, the gun in my sword. mind, it was like, Oh my god, I don't remember it being a musical. Uh, Fuck yeah, yeah dude. I love it's this movie. It's so bad, but it's so it's fun. so good. Oh my god. It's, the opening scene alone is one of the best scenes of any movie ever. No, you know how, like, when you're a kid, you watch movies and you grade things higher? When I was a kid, I fucking hated this movie. Oh, <laughs> so I, I can I imagine what it's going to be now. I watched it in high school after we finished reading we Romeo all, and yep, Juliet. We, it in high school as well. we got the choice between watching this and Romeo and Juliet. My class unanimous, unanimously voted to watch Romeo plus Juliet. 